Hello everybody, today I'm gonna show you how to bypass an SCR system on a Freilander Cascadia. Before starting this video, I wanna mention that the SCR bypass doesn't mean that you're gonna delete your SCR system on your truck. Uh, what we're gonna do is just to trick the computer to believe that the SCR system is working fine. So these two codes means that the SCR conversion is very low and the computer is setting this code as a warning then the SCR system is not reducing the emissions so uh, after checking the truck after looking around for all the SCR components the EDF pressure, the EDF air pressure, the temperatures, the uh, fuel uh, the fuel dosing, the DEF dosing and every other component then works with the DEF and the SCR system after checking all of them everything is working fine and there is nothing else to check after that uh, the only thing you have to do is to replace the SCR uh, box but the SCR box is very expensive uh, it costs around seven thousand dollars depending on the year and application of your truck of the DD15 engine uh, the easiest way to fix this problem uh, temporarily is to uh, bypass the SCR, the SCR outlet uh, knock sensor which is located on the SCR to do the bypass on the SCR system all we need is a new SCR sensor this is the part number the SCR and DPF uh, box filter is located here on the, the passenger door so we have to remove that fender this is the D DPF SCR filter the knock sensor are located here this cable here is for the inlet uh, SCR uh, knock sensor and the other one right here, the gray one, is for the outlet SCR sensor. So we gonna bypass the outlet, the outlet sensor, which is the gray one. It goes right to the back of the uh, SCR system. So the outlet SCR sensor is the one that is here. This uh, gray cable is right here. It is connected to this uh, module here. Place the screwdriver on the back like this and pull it up like that. And move it up and the plug is out. So after removing the plug, it's time to install the new sensor. We're gonna leave the sensor in here. In in here. We won't we won't remove this sensor from uh, the filter. We're gonna leave this sensor in there and this new sensor we're just gonna leave it sitting in here with the new sensor connected to the plug uh, we just going to find a way how to leave this as a sensor uh, the module on the sensor inside this little box find a way how it can be here now the sensor is in here in the box. It doesn't even look like is there is uh, is anything in there, which is good. So now it's time to st test the truck and see how the SCR conversion is now. After placing the sensor on the SCR box, we have to run the engine until it warms up, so we can do a region to see the conversion of the SCR system. So with the region in progress. We got 100% of efficiency. The outlet knock sensor is zero, which is good. So uh, now you can see that all the SCR system is working normally. There is no modification to the system. Everything is working as it normally does. So this will fix your problem. So you can run your truck for a while Meanwhile, you can make some money to repair your SCR box. This is all I'm going to show you about bypassing the SCR system. Uh, this uh, bypass will work with the Cummins ISX as well. You can do the same uh, thing to remove the knock sensor, press it out, and it will work the same way. 
So I hope this video helped you. Thank you very much for your time and have a great day.